And now for something completely different. Robertson and Luttrell head to the South American nation of Uruguay to hunt one of the country's great native game birds, the Perdiz. I got my game face on. He's got his game face on. I don't know what the hell he thinks he's doing. Texas gives way to Uruguay, and this is where Scott Robertson and Marcus Luttrell have come to hunt perhaps the gamest upland bird in South America, the fast-flying Perdiz. We're at Los Gachos down in Uruguay. We're about to go shoot some Perdiz. I've never been Perdiz hunting down here, but I hear it's great. I'm looking forward to it, so we'll see what happens. This bird's called a spotted tenement. Uh, here they call it a perdiz in South America. Obviously it's an upland bird. Surprising to most people, it doesn't covey. When they fly, uh, they typically uh, rise up and punch out low and hard. We can assure you that um, you're gonna find each flush to be different and you know each one to be a little bit challenging in a different way. Everybody good? Ready to go? Ready to hunt? Ready to shoot? Let's get it on, let's go. Release the hounds! Who wears that, really? It gives me crap all the time about my clothes not matching, but does that really match? And if it does, his gun doesn't match. This is my Marcus Luttrell deflector shield. That is, is what true. I got going here. He wears that so he makes sure I don't shoot him. <laughs> you bet your bippy. Anybody, you ever seen him shoot? No. Hi. Too much. I'm just behind it. I'm putting Marcus in the same category as Dick Cheney. I don't have my bulletproof vest, but I do have my orange on, so I think I'm in good shape. Heck yeah, let's check it out. Hey, Scott, did you just shoot straight into her? Yeah, you want to shoot at the feet. OK. OK, because <laughs> these things are still low. because That's cool. Right, see these these birds aren't climbing much. They're going straight. Right. Okay, just like when you're shooting a duck on the water, you gotta shoot at Same his feet. So you wanna just come up right at the bottom, and as you get to the bottom, shoot, and you'll just follow through right into it. Nice shooting. Get it, get it. I got him, I got him. I got, my sky, I, got, I got my game face on. He's got his game face on. I don't know what the hell he thinks he's doing. Oh, my goodness sakes. Marcus would pull a lot more women if he had the Scotty mask. He's obviously going to shoot better. He can't shoot a whole lot worse. Marcus was flying solo for two days in South America, so he created a stickman Scotty to keep him company. Never leave a man behind. You know what I, you know? And now Marcus is using it as his good luck charm. Got it! Damn, you got one. I got two. You got lucky. I wasn't going to let you have one. And that one was on your side. It's OK, number two. I ain't letting you shoot nothing today. That's it. You already messed up, Potnik, because I got the first kill. I don't know what you're talking about. I killed that bird over there. I'll bet you might see it on the airplane that I killed that bird. You didn't kill that bird. I, I, hey, this guy right here, kill that bird. <laughs> oh, somebody help me. Put me out of my misery. Notice how Latrell walks ahead of everybody, blocking the shot, making sure that he's in the position. No wonder he gets all the shooting. That's how Scotty always complains about everything. <laughs> I'm hungry. I go to the bathroom. My feet hurt. Marcus beat me in shooting again. Ah, uh -huh. ridiculous. Okay, now there's no way in hell you can claim that one. <clears throat> You're gonna have to take the mask off. Well, how do you know you killed it? Because I shot in between your two shots, which is with the exact time that that bird hit the ground. That doesn't mean that I didn't shoot it. <laughs> You're honestly going to claim that one too? Lord, he thinks if he pulls the trigger, the bird falls. 
I've been shooting for 31 years, and I really couldn't tell that I hit that bird. <clears throat> you know what? I've been going to the bathroom for 31 years, but sometimes I still pee on the toilet seat. I told you, don't shoot so that you can't claim it. Oh, you hit it. <laughs> God, he hit one! Nice shooting. That's three, amigo. I'm gonna have to rethink my strategy, though. Latrell's actually learning how to do this pretty well. I've kind of created a monster. I maybe should have waited a day or two before I taught him how to do it. Yeah! Good job, Marcus. Uruguay Perdiz, this is cool. This Perdiz hunt's pretty fun. I had a ball and I had a great time hunting with Marcus. We're always competitive with one another. And, um, you know, we did teach him how to shoot this week and he's starting to get pretty good, which kind of is troubling. It's a great experience. I mean, these birds are fast. I mean, I'm not even a bird hunter, I'm having a blast. I love it out here. Plus having Scotty out here helps tremendously. Being able to come out here and walk the grounds with a world champion uh, shooter is, is a real honor. It's as good as it gets, getting to hunt with some good buddies and South America eating good food, best hunting in the world. Just living the dream.